Hello everyone, Yuki from Anthropology, and happy holidays! Today's on Top Live, we're going to talk about some ornaments and how you can create multiple design variations just by changing up a couple of variables. Also, stay till the end to find out how you can download this file and maybe print some of your own custom ornaments using our end top file. Let's get straight into it. So over here, I have this workflow where it takes this sphere, shells it, then places some points on the sphere where I want to perforate. I then added some polygons and used some boolean operations to perforate our shell sphere using those polygons normal to the surface. Lastly, I added a topper and boolean union together to create our final ornament. Now I know this workflow works, but I want to be able to create multiple ornaments with different polygons perforated through my sphere. With Anthropology's reusable workflow capability, I'm able to do that. So we can create these things called custom blocks, where essentially you're creating your own block in Anthropology to perform certain tasks. In this case, we're creating an ornament. So I can take out variables I want to be able to control, such as the number of perforations, the thickness of the ornament, the number of sides of the polygons, and maybe the radius of the polygons. I can take all those and other variables out, put them into the input of my notebook, and obviously as our output, we want our final power, the ornament. So with this top file saved, I can then bring in a new instance of ntop and I can import this custom block into our workflow. And in doing so, you'll notice that the custom block I imported only shows me the variables I dragged into the input of my other ntop file that I saved. Now by changing up a couple of variables, these values, I'm able to create a whole new ornament without the need of recreating the entire workflow I have created for one. With this custom block, I can create many more ornaments in a very short amount of time because of the reusable workflow capability. I added a couple more custom blocks into this top file for you to be able to download and create different ornaments. We have one where you can perforate using some polygons, one where it creates a Voronoi lattice on the boundary of the sphere, and one where it creates a conformal lattice on the sphere where you can also change up the unit type to get a different lattice pattern. I hope you enjoyed today's video and got a good understanding of how we can use the reusable workflow capability on something like an ornament to our advantage. I hope you learned something new today, and happy holidays! If you want to download this on top file, go to anthropology.com under resources, videos, find this on top live, and at the bottom, just fill out this form and download the on top file. If you want to learn more about anthropology, contact us by filling out a form to speak with an on top expert. Lastly, check out our support page at support.anthropology.com and type your questions here if you have any other questions. Thank you!